hey guys welcome back to another slight work video yes we are on a roll okay today i'm giving my friend a nice little silk press or whatever you know i always start off with my fantasia heat protectant i always forget the name but it's the fantasia heat protectant okay it's amazing i love it and yeah so we're gonna blow dry keeping a lot of tension at the roots to make sure that we get this extra curly hair extra straight okay and i'm going in with my dyson supersonic blow dryer to do that as well as my paul mitchell paddle brush the perfect duo you already know um i think blow drying is kind of boring so i sped through this real quick so yeah I recently purchased the Babyliss Pro mini flat irons to get them kitchens and them edges, okay? Because everything needs to be straight. You don't need no little beady beads and taco meat on the back of your head. So I purchased these. I like them so far. Gotta get used to them, but they get really, really, really hot. Um, and then of course I'm going in with my new me straightener, my holy grail, my baby, my baby. If y'all got something better, tell me because I just don't see anything being better than this. I don't know. Maybe I just don't know a lot about hair straighteners. But yeah, we're going to use the chasing method. One pass is really all you need. Focus on the roots and then boom, you know what I'm saying? We're good. <laughs> I'm still working on these angles, trying to get this shoulder out the camera. Come on, sis, move over. <laughs> I'm still working on it. I'm really working in a small space. So, you know, it's going to get better with time. Just bear with me, okay? Bear with me. Now she does have a little bit of breakage from her color that she previously had. No, I did not do it. Um, but yeah, she just has a little bit of breakage. I did recommend her to deep condition a little more often and keep that hair moisturized so that that hair can grow back and regain its strength. Now we're gonna go in and clip these ends. Her ends really weren't that bad, you know. But I did start off in the chair, wasn't feeling the angle because of the way that the chair made the hair go. Because it was it was longer. I don't know how to explain it. So I had her stand up to get a more precise cut. And like always, I always do a mini consultation with my clients. Let them see how much um, that they want taken off. I can't, you know, make the decision for them or else they're not going to come back. So yeah. Now I'm just gonna add some loose curls to give her some body.
and that is the final look i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give me a big thumbs up leave a nice and positive comment below and i will see y'all in my next light work video bye